I don't know where the cloud is, but <laughs> send it there. <laughs> yes. Should be good. Yes. Okay. That's recording. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Mr. Sabalai, Christy Wadden, Zaymasi. Visit Nepal, Ministry Training Ma, Pulpit Ministry Kutapavata, Ma Pasati Pasel, Yahola Ferry Prince Ragan Gadasu, Amelie Bishwaska, Bishayuma, Sikir Rikasuri, Dinoruma Ferry Penny. I mean, as I did, and Bishwas could prat na kosari garni. Bani baare ma, I mean, sikhe song. Ra, I mean, lai Prabhu ko pasand sikhao na kolagi. Reverend Tony Abraham aur Bisma ununsa. Ra, I mean, lai saral bahasa ma sikhao na kolagi. Saral bahasa ma anubad garna kolagi. Pastor Kishan aur Bisma ununsa. Waha le, I mean, lai sajil bahasa ma bujay din unesa. Ra, is samay. मोहारा दिन चाहनुं उन सब पर मिश्र का आत्मा ले वहाँ लाई अभिषेक गनुभाई को सब ताकि वहाँ ले आनी हमें लाई पर मिश्र को तो शिकाऊं नहीं सब उन सब पर बोला तने बाद उस प्लीज थैंक यू पास्टर टी पैक इट इज अ जॉय वंस अगेन टू बी एबल टू शेयर विथ यू फ्रॉम द वर्ड ऑफ गॉड धन्य पास्टर दी को � and these sessions that we've been having uh, with evangelism and and soul winning and discipleship is very important. Rahami, just like this, we're learning about the song, Chelapan, ko baare ma, Susamanta, Purchar, ko baare ma, hamle Vishwas, ko baare ma, we're learning about the song. Ekta mai asal prakar ka mahan prakar ka kura hui. And in my last session, I shared how that uh, there are commandments of faith. अंतिम कक्षा में मौजूद तो पहले को बीच में कुरा करें कि कौशली हम लाइक विश्वास को दस वड़ा आगे आरुषण बने रहा। Because faith is like the engine in a in a car on an automobile. It gives us the power to go. यो चाहे ये वड़ा कार में ये वड़ा गाड़ी में चाहे इंजन जस्ते हो विश्वास लेते हम लाइक आगे आरी बड़ा उनसा। Paul the apostle said in Galatians two and twenty, I live. By the faith of the Son of God. Right, Paul le Galati dui ko bish pa wale banunsa ma bishwas dwara chahi ma hirdasu banero wale banunsa. And God, God's word uh, is how we have our faith growing in us. Right, Paul minister ko bachan nahi ho jasle hamro bishwas lai bar na ko lagi saheta garsa. And and I think one of the most important things to know. As a disciple, as a minister, is how to put that faith to work in our lives. जो ये वाला हमें मॉडली का ये वाला शिवक ये वाला चिला शिवक भाई को कारण ले गोड़ा हम लेते हो विश्वास लाइक कौन से ले हम लोग काम में हम लोग विवाहर में लागू करने भरने को हमें सीखने को आवश्यक था. And uh, in this session, I want to give you a a spiritual formula how to pray the prayer of faith. रा अब हम तब हम को बीस में बोला आत्मी की प्रकार को रा सूत्र बताना चाहें तो कौशली हमले प्रार्थना कर दा कि विश्वास साथ प्रार्थना कर रा सकें चाहता। And uh, I'm going to give this to you at the end. Uh, I remember in school the teacher would give us homework, and at the end of this session I am going to give you a little bit of homework. अने मौज है आज जो सरी ये वाला स्कूल में पढ़ाई सके पच्चे अंतिम में होमवर्क दिन सो ग्रह कार्य दिन सो तीसरे नहीं आज हम तो पहले अंतिम में की ग्रह कार्य पन दिन है शो। But but this is good home homework. It will not be difficult. रा तब यार बोला कि वो साजी लोग पर कार्य को ग्रह कार्य होने सो होमवर्क होने सो। It'll help you to be able to pray the prayer of faith. रामातपाह हर लाइट साइन ये सरी प्रार्थना करने सीखा� now there are different prayers that can be prayed. For example, the prayer for salvation. त्यां धेरे ही प्रकार का प्रार्थना हर गणना सकें चाहो जस्ते युद्ध उदाहरण को लागी उदा मुक्ति को लागी प्रार्थना करने को रा. Or the prayer of thanksgiving. और को चाहे धन्यवाद को प्रार्थना करना सकें चाहो. But what I want to share with you is the prayer of faith. 
तर मैले तपाईहरुलाई सिकाउन गइराखेको छ यो चाहिँ विश्वासको प्रार्थना हो and to find uh, the theme of it we need to look in the book of james aba hami cha jo yakub ko pustak ko chai jo mukhya bishay vastu ho shiksha ho tesai la hami dhyan dera herne chau in the fifth chapter the 14th verse ra tya chai 5 ko jo 14 pad ma esar likheko cha i'm going to read it in english and my dear brother kisan is going to read it in your language ma tapai har ko lagi english ma padhinchu ra yaha pastor kisan le tapai har ko lagi nepali ma padhinu hune cha there are three verses we're going to read here hami tin wada pad ha padna gai reka chau is there any sick among you let him call for the elders of the church and let them pray over him anointing him with oil in the name of the lord ke timi haru madhe koi birami cha tesle mandali ka elder har lai bolaos तिनीहरुले प्रभुको नाउमा त्यसलाई तेलले अभिषेक गरेर त्यसको निम्ति प्रार्थना गरुन् एन्ड द प्रेयर अफ फेथ शल सेव द सिक से दैट पार्ट ब्रदर र विश्वासको प्रार्थनाले बिरामीलाई बचाउने छ नाउ दैट्स गोइंग टु बी द की द अफ माय मेसेज एन्ड माय टीचिंग द प्रेयर अफ फेथ शल सेव द सिक प्रमुख विषय यही हुने छ and it says and the lord will raise them up and if you've committed sins they shall be forgiven him ra ya lekheko cha ra prabhu le teslai niko parnu hune cha ra yadi tesle paap gareko cha bhane teslai chema hune cha confess your faults one to another and pray one for another that you may be healed the effectual fervent prayer of a righteous man availeth much यस कारण तिमी एवटा ने अर् पाप स्वीकार कर तिमी निको होना एवटा ने अर् को निम्ति प्रार्थना कर धार्मिक मानस को प्रार्थना शक्तिशाली रभावशाली होमें यहाँ भि कोई बिरामी मंडली का एल्डर सेवक बोलाओस् प्रार्थना कर I don't know if I shared this with you or not in one of the sessions because I I speak on in different places. Ra ya ma tapai har ko bich ma yo kina kura garna gai rachu kina ni yo farak prakar ko kaccha ma yo kura garnu parne ho vastav mo sari ta herda. But but it it will make this point known very good to you. Tara yo kura le tapai lai ramro prakar le bujna lai sahayata puryaune cha. I was preaching in Honduras, Central America. यो अमेरिका को सेंट्रल भाग में चाहे यो एक्चुअली प्रचार कर रखे को थिए एंड वी वर इन अ क्रुसेड बट आई वाज सिक हम ये वाला क्रुसेड में थियो तेरी बेला मौ बिरामी पड़े आई थिंक आई हैड मलेरिया आ मौला तेरी बेला मलेरिया भाई को थियो क्योंस वी हैड बीन इन अफ्रीका एंड एंड आई बिलीव आई कांटैक्टेड मलेरिया � हमी तो भाग अफ्रिका में थी रेती बेला अफ्रिका में हुआ सायद लमखुटी टोक हो मलेरिया बीमारी होना पुगे अब मलेरिया को उपचार छेन तम प्रकार के अब आराम कर रही समय पच्चीस मैं एकदम बिरामी भे मेरे एकदम ज्वर आलो मेरे पसिना जब यो अमेरिका भाग में जब हंडोरस भाई क्रुसेड कर भून थाली बीमार देखी थे र दिन भरी नहीं मौत आई खाट मासूती रहे मौ कापी रहे को थिए जोर आई रहे को थियो। But my wife would come and pray for me and I would get up strong enough I'd go and preach but then after I was done preaching I would come back and shake again। र मेरे सिर में ते आऊँ बहुत मेरे लायक प्रार्थना कर दिन बहुत मौली कती बलियो बहे मौ पुलपिर में गर प्रचार करे प्रचार करे फिर फोड़ के पची फिर ही पनी मौ बिस्तर में यो यसरी नै लगभग 4-5 दिन सम्म लगातार भइरह्यो फाइनली आई सेड टु माय वाइफ 
call the elders, call the ministers that are cooperating with the crusade to come and lay hands on me. अन्तमा मैले चाहिँ मेरो श्रीमतीलाई भने यो सेवकायमा जति पनि सहभागी पास्टरहरु अगुवाहरु एल्डरहरु हुनुहुन्छ उहाँहरुलाई बोलाउ र उनीहरुले मेरो लागि प्रार्थना गर्दिउन मैले भने एन्ड हियर फोर अर फाइभ पास्टर्स केम र चार पाँच जना पास्टरहरु यहाँ आउनु भयो म कहाँ एन्ड आई टोल्ड हिम आई वांटेड देम लेय हैंड्स ऑन मी एन्ड प्रे फॉर मी र मैले भने उहाँहरुलाई मेरो माथि हात राखिदिनुस् र मेरो लागि प्रार्थना गर्दिनुस् भने एन्ड दे वर अफ्रेड दे सेड ओ यू यू आर यू आर द इवेंजलिस्ट You were the one. How can how can we pray for you? उन्हें अर्थात डरा है जस्तु कुरागोसन तपाईं तेरा महान इबांजलिस्ट होनुं सा कौसर यानी तपाईं को लागि प्रार्थना गर्दी भनेर भन्ना थाले. I said I'm no different than you. We are all children of God. मैले उन्हें लाई भने तपाईं र हामी कोई फरक सही नो तपाईं हामी सबै जना परमिशन का छोरा छोरी हरु हों. And then these five brethren laid their hands on me and they prayed. अनि ती पाँच जना पास्टरहरुले मेरो माथि हात राखेर उहाँले प्रार्थना गर्दिनु भयो एन्ड जस्ट लाइक द बाइबल सेज हियर व्हेन दे प्रेड फर मी आई वाज हिल्ड एन्ड नेभर हैड एनी मोर मलेरिया अटैक्स सिन्स दैट टाइम र जसरी बाइबलले या भन्दो छ जसरी तिनीहरुले मलाई प्रार्थना गरे र त्यति नै गरी म चाहिँ निको भए त्यसपछि त्यो मलेरियाको कुनै पनि लक्षण मेरो जीवनमा देखिएन फेरि सो द बाइबल सेज लेट देम प्रे द प्रेयर ऑफ फेथ एन्ड इफ दे आर सिक The Lord will raise them up. Raya Bible le bansa the elder le prayatna gardi un edi tinar bimar chon mane tinar chaey uthne chon. Now the question is, who can pray this prayer? Raba prashna ki urcha bale kosle esari prayatna gona saksa. The Bible says the prayer of a righteous man. Raba Bible le bansa ki bharmi mane sole prayatna gorun mane ra. Well, who is righteous? This is about Dharmi Kosata. Well, now we have to turn in the Bible to see. I mean, Bible only part of it. Here we are, so you can. In Second Corinthians, Second Corinthians, the fifth chapter, the twenty-first verse, it says that God hath made him to be sin for us who knew no sin. that we might be made the righteousness of god in him raya excuse me verse please excuse me i second corinthians 5:21 a dosro karanti 5 ko 21 pad lai ma ya padi dine chu ya esari likheko cha kinaki hami uha ma parmeshwar ko dharmikta banna sakau bhanera paap nachinnu hune lai parmeshwar le hamra khatir paap banaunu bhayo amen Do you know that when you come to Jesus, He washes your sins away, and you become you become righteous. The job of the Bible is to let us ask on the boy who has the Bible of Paul, who has the new Bible, and who has the Bible of the Hermit, who has the new Bible. And you never grow in righteousness; you only grow in holiness. Now, the Bible of the Hermit is not born again, but the Bible of the Hermit is born again. The moment you come to Jesus, and He makes you His child, you become righteous in the sight of God. Kira vane jun din Yeshu prabhu le tapai le viswas karnu bo garan karnu bo tei din tapai le mo Yeshu ko gari dharmi thori ye ka mani suru ho. Now, no matter what you do, you cannot be more righteous than when you are saved. अब तपाईले जेसुकै जस्तो जुकै काम गर्नुस् तपाई जति धर्मी ठरेर म त्यो भन्दा बढी धर्मी तपाई बन्न सक्नु हुँदैन बट यु क्यान ग्रो इन होलीनेस तर तपाई पवित्रतामा बढ्दै जानु हुनेछ सो हु क्यान प्रे दिस प्रेयर अफ फेथ द राइटियस पर्सन विश्वासको प्रार्थना गर्न सक्छ त द राइटियस पर्सन वी आर राइटियस र त्यो धर्मी व्यक्तिले प्रार्थना गर्न सक्छ तपाई र म चाहिँ धर्मी ठरेका मानिसहरु हौ God has made us righteous. Paul Mister, you have made us righteous. So we can pray the prayer of faith. This is the God that I am. I can pray the prayer of faith. I can pray the prayer of faith. Isn't that what we just read in James? You are the book that we have read. Jacob has written about it. And we can have confidence in Him. I am. 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 Because God 
has washed our sins away and has written our names in the book of life. So that's how we pray the prayer of faith because we are righteous. Now, there must be a formula to play, pray this prayer of faith, I'm sure. So I want to give you the formula, the steps we must do to pray the prayer of faith. So first our prayers must be directed to our heavenly Father. You remember when the disciples came to Jesus, they said, Lord, teach us to pray. And the first thing he taught them was to say, Our Father in heaven. So that's what, that is the first step if you're going to pray the prayer of faith. We don't pray to the angels, we don't pray to the saints. We don't pr pray to uh, an idol. We pray to the Father God. And then the second thing we must do, we've, we've got to ask in faith. How do you ask in faith? Well, you have to ask according to the will of God. And how do you find the will of God? Well, the New Testament is God's perfect will of God for your life. Now, very often I have people come to me and say, Tony Abram, pray for me that I might know the will of God. And they'll run around asking all different preachers the same question. Pray that I might know the will of God. But they're looking for someone who will agree with them uh, and with what they want to do. But I tell them, read the word of God. That is the will of God for your life. So we, our prayers are directed to the Father and, and we ask in His name in faith. We don't ask in the name of a saint we, or a a, a statue or an idol, we ask in the name of Jesus. And oh, it's just so wonderful to know that we can come to our Heavenly Father. Sometimes I think, what am I? I'm just a piece of clay, and yet I can come and talk to my Heavenly Father. I, I am so unworthy, and yet I can come to Him with my requests. 
मो बिन्ती अंतर बिन्ती लहां को अगड़ी आने को एकदम म अयोग्य काम नलाने मं हूँ and i have the authority and the power of the name of jesus christ tara yesu ko naam ma mala adhikar ra shakti diyeko cha ma waha ko agadi gara yo magna sakchu listen to what jesus said in mark 11 and 24 aba markus ami 11 ko 24 pad ma yesu le ke bhannu bhayeko cha ami telai herau therefore i say to you what things soever you desire when you pray believe that you receive them and you shall have them es karan ma timiharu lai bhandachu timiharu le prarthna ma jesu kai magchau so paeka chau bhanne vishwas rakha ra tyo timiharu ko hune cha and then we must ask according to the will of god which is the bible ra arko kura hami chai parmeshwar ko ichha anusar magnu parcha jun kura chai parmeshwar ko vachan ho Think right now while you're sitting there is there something I need from the father today Tapai ja basirakhnu bhako cha ta ekchi sochnuhos ke tapai lai parmeshwar ko tira bare kehi chaiyeko cha Is there something I need from God today Aaja malai kehi kura ko avashyakta cha Then I, you need to come to your father in faith and use the name of Jesus Christ. Ra aba tapai parmeshwar pita ka aunu hos ra vishwas sath parmeshwar pita sanga Yesu ko naam ma mangnu hos. And after you pray, you got to hold on that you're going to receive the answer. Jab tapai le prarthna garnu huncha tes pachi tyo kura ba nischit hunu hos tesla pakdi rakhnu hos tapai le pai sake bhanera vishwas garnu hos. And because you've asked according to the will of God the Bible you have this confidence he is going to answer jab tapai le magnu huncha parmeshwar ko vachan anusar ichha anusar magnu huncha tedi bela tapai le tyo prapt garnu huncha tyo paune aasha pani tapai ma bolyo bhara huncha we must have a positive positive confession hami sabai ma euta sakaratmak prakar ko tyo aasha chai hunu parcha let me give you an example I was preaching years ago in Miami, Florida. And uh, there was a woman who had a cancer on her head. And I remember her coming forward for prayer. And we i had preached that night about confessing the word of god and holding on to the promise of god yo beluki ma chai parmeshwar ko vachan lai swikar garne ra parmeshwar ko pratigya lai samatne bhanne bishaya prachar gari rakheko thie and i remember when after we prayed she says hallelujah i'm healed i'm healed i'm healed हमें प्रचार कर मैं प्रचार कर सके स्त्री ने भाई हाल लो मो भो भो राखिन्न She came we heard this later because that was our last night in that crusade. Tyo hamro lagi antim din thiyo tya crusade ko ra pachi hamle yo kura sunyau. But on Wednesday she came to her church. Ra budhabar din mandali ma ayin. And she stood up and said praise God Sunday night Jesus healed me of my cancer. र उनले भनेन कि परमेश्वरको स्तुति होस् किनभने आइतबारको बेलुकी परमेश्वरले मेरो क्यान्सरलाई निको पार्नु भयो भनिन् एन्ड द पीपल वर लुकिंग एट हर र मानिसहरुले उनलाई हेरे एन्ड सम से वेल प्रेज गॉड यस प्रेज गॉड आर कतिले भने ह परमेश्वरको स्तुति होस् परमेश्वरको स्तुति होस् भने बट दे कुड स्टिल सी द क्यान्सर तर मान्छेहरुले अझै उनको टाउकोमा क्यान्सर देखिरहेकै थिए एन्ड सम थॉट ओ इट्स अ शी शी इज नॉट रियली हील शी जस्ट mixed up in her head ra kadile bhanya yo ajai pani niko bhai sakeko chaina tara unko mastishka ma yo kura basyo bhanne kura bhane every morning she got up praise god i'm healed i'm healed pratyek bihana tini uthne bela ma parmeshwar ko stuti hos ma niko bhaye bhanera bhanthin tini 
when she came to the meeting on Friday night. Again, she testified. Said Sunday night, Jesus healed my cancer. And now the people in the church thought, oh, she's mixed up. She, she's not healed because they could see the cancer. On Sunday morning, she woke up. Went into the bathroom and looked in the mirror. The cancer was gone. And she, and she went to her bed and there was like a dry skin scab laying by the pillow. So what, what happened? Well, Sunday night when she was prayed for, she believed she was healed. The roots were had died at that moment. And she kept confessing, holding on, and God gave her the victory. Sometimes we have to hold on to the promise of God. And sometimes that is very difficult. But we must have patience and have a positive confession. And sometimes that's very difficult to do. Now, how do we pray the prayer of faith? We come, first, we come to our Heavenly Father. Second, we come to the, we, we use the name of Jesus Christ. Because there's no other name like that name. There's power in that name. So we come to the Father in the name of Jesus. And we confess the promise of God. And we hold on to the promise of God. We sometimes it's difficult to hold on to the promise of God. But if we hold on, praise God, we'll get the victory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And so that's the formula. Go to the Father in the, name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus Christ. Believe it's done. And hold on. Now, all the promises of God are conditional. There is a condition when we pray the prayer of faith. And this is probably the most important verse of scripture or in the formula to pray the prayer of faith. And it's found in Mark, the 11th chapter, the 25th verse. And when you stand praying, forgive. If you have ought against you that your Father also which is in heaven may forgive your trespasses. 
जब तिमी प्रार्थना में खड़ा हो तब कस को विरुद्ध में तिमी को कही छमा कर ताकि स्वर्ग में हूँ तिमी का पिता ने तिमी का अपराध क्षमा कर दिन् The condition to see the answer to the prayer of faith is forgiveness. रो तपाइले विश्वास को प्रार्थना गर्ने कुराको लागि दिएको शर्त यो हो कि हामीले चाहिँ क्षमा गर्नु पर्छ. When we stand to pray, we must forgive. जब तपाईहरु प्रार्थनाको लागि खडा हुन्छौ हामीले क्षमा गर्नु पर्ने हुन्छ. If you have something in your heart against somebody else, you aren't able to pray that prayer of faith. Until you make it right. यदि तपाईं प्रार्थना गर्न जान्दै गर्दा कसै को विरुद्ध में तपाईं को रीढ़ में केही छ बने उलाई छेमा नगरी करना तपाईं विश्वास को प्रार्थना गर्न सक्नु हुन्न. Sometimes people have prayed and prayed and say, "Why is no answer?" Well, the reason is you might have something against somebody. कति पल्ट हामी प्रार्थना गर्छौ प्रार्थना गरिसकेपछि मान्छेले त्यसको उत्तर पाएन भने भन्छ यसको कारण यही हो कि तपाईं को विरुद्ध कसै को विरुद्ध में तपाईंले केही कुरा आफ्नो मनमा राख्नु भएछ र प्रार्थना गर्दै हुनुहुन्छ. and you need to forgive them first tesaile garda pahila tapai le unhalai chhema garnu parcha oh you say brother tony i i forgiven everybody i don't have anything against anybody aba tapai le bhannu hola tony brother maile ta sabai lai chhema gareko chu kasai ko viruddha mero viruddha ma kehi chhena bhannu hola you say i have forgiven everybody tapai le bhannu hola maile sabai lai chhema gareko chu do you realize that every time you bring up or think about someone who did you wrong you have to forgive them again in your heart yadi tapai kunai bela sochnu huncha kasai ko bare ma tapai le tapai ko virudh ma kehi gareko jasto lagcha bhane tapai le feri pani tinalai chhema garnu parne huncha for example i have a neighbor i have a neighbor who some years ago did something very bad mero chimeki hununcha jasle mero virudh ma dherai naramro garnu bhayeko thyo kehi barsha agadi He made a fire and he burned my garage and my truck little pickup truck and many things I had he burned it to the ground. Uh unle chai dherai barsha agadi chai mero truck mero tyas bhayeko saman haru lai chai aago lagaera jalai diyeko thiyo. He never asked said to me I'm sorry but I still forgave him. U kaile pani aera malai malai maaf garnu chhema garus bhanena tara pani maile ulai chhema gare. At first in my heart I felt why did he do that he did not have to do that Paila malai lagyo ki yele kina yesto garyo yesle yesto garnu pardaina thiyo bhane yesto lageko thiyo But I forgave him Tara maile ulai chhama gare But the uh, but a week ago I was talking to somebody Ma kai isko bare ma aur manche sang kai kura garirako thie And I told this man about my neighbor what he did र उस मान्छेले मेरो बारेमा के गरेको थियो त्यो बारे म बताएको थिए एन्ड यु नो व्हाट आई ह्याड टु डू मैले के आई ह्याड टु फर्गिव आई ह्याड टु फर्गिव हिम अगेन मैले फेरि पनि उसलाई क्षमा गर्नु पर्छ दैट्स व्हाई जीसस सेज यु फर्गिव 70 टाइम्स 7 त्यसैले त येशु प्रभुले भन्नुभयो 7 70 ही पटक क्षमा गर भनेर एभ्री टाइम यु ब्रिंग इट अप एन्ड टॉक टु अबाउट इट इन द uh you got to forgive again jaile pani tyo kura samjhinu huncha ya tapai le kasai sanga tesko barema kura garnu huncha tapai le feri pani chema garnu parcha but i know you're so good you probably weren't like me but i have to forgive tara malai lagcha tapai le ma jasto hunu hunna tara pani tapai le chai chema garnu parne huncha ma jastai but there's one more person you have to be able to forgive tya ek jana esto pani byakti huncha jaslai tapai le chema garna saknu parcha and that is yourself तपाईले आफैले आफैले क्षमा गर्न सक्नु पर्छ When you stand to pray yes you have to forgive others but you also have to forgive yourself जब तपाई प्रार्थनाको लागि खडा हुनुहुन्छ त्यतिबेला अरूलाई क्षमा गर्नु पर्छ त्यो एकदमै साच्चो कुरा हो तर यसको साथसाथै तपाईले आफैले आफैलाई पनि क्षमा गर्नु पर्ने हुन्छ You say brother Abram what 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 am I how what did I do I have to forgive मैले आफैले आफैले क्षमा गर्नको लागि मैले के गर्नु पर्छ भनेर तपाईले भन्नु होला I will tell you what unforgiveness to yourself is for unforgiveness to yourself is regrets म तपाईलाई एउटा कुरा भन्न चाहन्छु जब तपाईले आफैले आफैले क्षमा गर्न सक्नुहुन्न भने यसले तपाईलाई भित्र भित्रबाट खाइराखेको हुन्छ कमजोर बनाइराखेको हुन्छ 
maybe there is something you did in the past and you, uh, you, you and you need to for, forget about it. You need to forgive yourself. If you did something wrong in the past or you sinned in the past, you need to forgive yourself because God has already forgiven you. And you see, when God forgives you, He doesn't remember it anymore. That's how wonderful our Heavenly Father is. He forgives and He forgets. And we, if God forgives us, we need to forgive ourselves. Sometimes we have regrets. We wish, oh, I wish I would have done that, or I wish I would have helped that one or did that one. And that's on forgiveness. We need to forget about the past. That's what the Apostle Paul said. He said, forgetting the past, I press toward the mark for the prize of the high calling of God in Jesus. Let me give you an example. Here was a woman who had a baby before she was married. Uh, later, she became a Christian. And she married and had five more children. And she loved all her children and prayed for all her children. But the five children she had with her husband, he, they all were serving God. But the one who did not, which was born uh, before she was married to another man, that one was not serving the Lord. And this mother could just regret and regret and regret. And she she would when she would pray she would think why why did i do that why why and this is what the Apostle Paul said when she realized, oh, I've never forgiven myself. And she forgave herself. And four weeks later, her other daughter came to Jesus. You see, unforgiveness towards herself, regrets, was holding back the answer to the prayer of faith. Yeah, Herus, so, how do we pray the prayer of faith? We stand 
on the promise of God. We direct our, we direct our prayer to the Father in the name of Jesus. We forgive everyone, we forgive ourselves. And we hold on with patience for the answer. Sometimes the answer comes quickly, sometimes we have to wait. My mother prayed for my father for 21 years, but he came to Jesus. Praise the Lord. Now, are you ready to pray the prayer of faith? I believe you are if you follow this formula. Only a believer can pray the prayer of faith. Only a disciple can pray the prayer of faith. And you are a child of God. Okay, here's the homework. I want you to, when you have time, I want you to do this. I want you to take this portion of scripture Read it and memorize it if you can. It's Romans, the eighth chapter, the 14 to the 17th verse. And then the second portion, Galatians. The fourth chapter, the seventh verse, to, from one to seven. And if you study and memorize those scriptures, you're going to be strong and be able to pray the prayer of faith. Now, it's been a joy, these sessions I've had with you. And Evangelist Walter uh, said, uh, Brother Tony, would you do it a few more lessons? And I said, yes, I will. I told Walter, I have such a good interpreter. In Brother Kisan. Brother Interpreter, Pastor Kisan And today I was reading a little bit about your country of Nepal. I knew that you had the world's highest mountain, Mount Emrus. And I learned that you have a, a wonderful country with 20, about 21 million people. And what I read was all good. But only one problem I saw. Not everybody is a believer in Jesus. And it's my prayer and my desire to see a great revival come to your country. That God will bless you spiritually, physically, materially. I've been in two countries in my life when a great revival took place. And 
and from the presidents all the way down to the poorest people were shaken by the power of God and thousands and thousands came to Jesus and many, many churches were planted. And we are praying that you will have that happen in Nepal. It's been a blessing for me and I'm glad that I will continue with a few more lessons. Now on to our next session, Tony and Marge Abram love you, but God loves you more. So God bless you, good day, good night, wherever you are. Good night, uh, good morning. Amen. God bless Amen. you.